what is the digital mine? The digital mine is, is, I think, an interim phase. It is a smart mine. It is understanding in real term, on surface, what is happening underground and the ability to communicate in two ways so that we, so we can save costs by warning a work, worker underground that he or she should not proceed in a particular direction. They must turn around because they are entering a high-risk area. Alternatively, understanding production flow and where losses occur to, be, to know in real time where the loss occur, the loss of material occur, and then to do the remedial action from the, from the all the instructions from the control room. I think by doing that we'll add a lot to bottom line, and that's in, that's mining intelligently by just understanding what's happening underground. One of the, the the issues of a digital mine is not to go and reinvent the wheel. You take technologies that are proven on surface, like for example a satellite and it can do many things, but take that, that surface technology and adapt it and put it underground. Extend surface technologies into the underground environment. Uh, and this is the objective of our digital mine project. While extending surface technologies underground, we also want to put distance between the worker and the high-risk areas. Because if you start monitoring underground conditions, you know where the high-risk areas are in real time. And if you have the ability to, commit to, to, to locate a worker relative to that risk and then to communicate to, 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 to a control room and back, one can add enormous value, not only in saving lives, but also economic value. And what will we see now when we go down there? We'll see a tunnel, uh, but it's a real tunnel. We have used all the construction materials that's used underground, but it's different because it's a tunnel on the internet. We just started with making the tunnel smart. Uh, we've got exciting research projects on it. One is an underground satellite that will roam the space. Uh, we're build, busy building the prototype for that and everything that the satellite can do in the air. Uh, the next stage is to add a stope to the mock mine and uh, an intelligent uh, lamp room with the kind of technologies that you find on airports where if someone has a fever there will be an alarm going off and the person will be prevented to go underground into the mine because you cannot have sick people underground. It can only add to the risk. We have a teaching facility for our students. We can do a whole lot of undergraduate exercises in the tunnel. What does this cost? That facility uh, came in at an unbelievably low price of just under 600,000 rand. There's goodwill out there, like the Stoke, we've already got a sponsor who, who, who will pay for the majority of that. And uh, the lamp room is, uh, we're also speaking to a company who's in the smart technology space.